is a failure that occurred during one of your space flights, and how did the crew handle it? Well, that, that's a really good question. Uh, you know, I've <clears throat> got a little over 200 days in space, and let me tell you that failures happen. And uh, the one thing I learned is that the best way to react to a failure is to be ready for it in the first place. And uh, everything we do up here involves a lot of planning and uh, having backup systems and methods to handle things. When I first arrived at the space station on the Soyuz, our automatic docking uh, system failed, and we were trained and uh, equipped to bring it in uh, manually, and we did that. And uh, more recently here, when uh, I had uh, Steve Bowen out on the end of the robotic arm, and he had a big, big heavy piece of very expensive hardware, and our robotic workstation crashed. And, uh, you know, that's not a good place to be, but we had a backup system. And the space station crew, in a very calm, very cool-headed, but very quick response, brought up that uh, secondary workstation. And uh, within a few minutes, we were back in business and good to go, and, uh, and Steve was moving again. So, <laughs> seemed a long time to Steve, but uh, obviously being prepared is is the the biggest thing, and uh, it's just it's great to see that when uh, everything is in order and the crew reacts to their training and uh, cool heads, and you're back in business really fast.